Well, if you're still looking for a sale on school supplies, look no further. This Friday starts tax-free weekend, and CBS 19's Ashley French spoke to parents and officials to see if they'll be taking advantage of the annual event. As the school year quickly approaches, parents, guardians, and teachers are gearing up for the annual tax-free weekend sales event. This year is a lot more important, especially to my family. Our family actually did um, contract COVID, and so we did spend a lot of time not able to work. And so we are always looking in ways to cut corners and save. Every little bit counts right now. Anything that can help a, a working working mom, working dad, a uh, single parent, just take advantage of to help them out. It, it, it's, it's great. Whether you're shopping online or in person, shopping for school supplies can be a stressful time. The CEO and president of the BBB of Central East Texas advises parents to follow a few simple tips before heading to the stores. Get your school supply list. Um, and the, what that does, it helps you stay within budget. So you want to make sure that you don't go over budget if you can um, and, and don't make too many impulse purchases, which is hard to do. But, but having a list ahead of time does help you to stay within your budget. And any item you plan to buy with a tax-free sales tag can't be more than $100. You know, just because something's not tax free doesn't mean you can't still get a discount on it. A lot of retailers will be providing discounts uh, for uh, different items that may not necessarily be included on the list. This year's sales tax holiday begins on Friday, August 6th and goes through midnight on Sunday, August 8th. We've got you covered East Texas. I'm Ashley French for CBS 19.